Andrey Rublev has addressed his latest outburst after repeatedly smashing his knee with his racket during his Wimbledon defeat. It's not the first time that the world number six has resorted to abusing himself with his equipment, as he also struck himself at the French Open and at the ATP Finals. The 26-year-old explained why he decided to hit himself rather than the court as he addressed fan concerns about his behavior. It was another early exit for Rublev as he was stunned by world number 122 Francisco Comsana in the first round at Wimbledon. The Argentine had never won a match at tour level but pulled off the upset to come through 6-45-76-27-6, 5. The Russian was clearly frustrated with his level and tensions boiled over when he went down a double break in the third set. Rublev attacked his knee with his racket as he walked back to his bench for the changeover, pausing for a moment before hitting himself again. It's a familiar sight with the 16-time title winner, who has struck himself during several matches in the past. And he explained why he decided to take his anger out on himself after losing on Tuesday. I would not do it if I was able to hit the wrecker on the floor. Because we're not allowed to hit them with the grass, the sixth seed admitted. I don't know why in that moment, I couldn't take it anymore. I needed to let emotions out. Rublev was informed that his fans were concerned after the distressing footage of him hitting his knee circulated online. He added, but thanks, everything is fine. Again, I was a bit lucky. After a similar outburst at the French Open, where he lost to Matteo Arnoldi in the third round, Rublev slammed his own behavior and it admitted that he needed to be kinder to himself on the court. Asked whether he still wanted to work on that, he replied, of course. Of course. It is the main problem that I need to improve. Of course, I didn't behave today as in Paris, but still I could do much better. This is not the way. Of course. It's the main priority, to be able during all the match to be positive.